Hi, I'm Travis, co-founder and director at Coursebox, and today I'm going to show you the three really cool things about Coursebox. The first one is we've got virtual instructional designers working for you tirelessly to help you structure and write and publish your course. Secondly, we've got virtual assessors going through the rubric, looking at the scenario that's been su submitted by the student, and then finally giving a grade breakdown, which pushes into your gradebook in your learning management system or into your course box gradebook. And finally, third thing that's really cool is we've got AI tutors. What is an AI tutor? It's a it's a chatbot that's been trained on your course content and we're going to be refining this further and further for a more personalized learning experience uh, over the year ahead. For example, training chatbots not just on the course content but also on the context of your profile, your history, your education and, and work results in your profile page, how you've done in courses and it really gives that personalized touch for the student uh, at the very least, when they when you get stuck during uh, you know some course content, you want to deep dive a bit further. So here we go. First thing is, what course do I want to box? Well, that's pretty easy. Let's just jump in and describe a course. Okay, we've got English UK selected, but I can change my language anytime. I can also choose to upload files or train my course on website pages, YouTube videos. But for now, I'm going to skip that step and just click next. Describe my learner, business professionals trying to use AI. Finally, course structure. Default is five objectives and one lesson, but I'm going to increase that to three lessons and five pages. Yes, it's going to write a quiz and an assignment for me, and quiz questions will be three. I'm pretty happy with those settings, so I'm going to go ahead and click next. Okay, it takes about 30 seconds usually for our AI to create your course structure, and this is that virtual instructional design step I was talking about. And there it is. So we've got a course title, description, objectives, course tags, and I can click these and expand them. Might not be immediately obvious, but I can edit, add additional quiz topics, topic pages, delete and refine my structure until I'm absolutely happy. And then this is ticked down the bottom, automatically write all the content for all my pages. Now this next step takes about 10 minutes. I just let that bake in the oven for a while, but you can see it's already created my course structure on the left and in the middle of the page. I'm on page one, it's writing my page content for me as we speak. It will also go ahead and recommend some pixels images for you that you can edit or enhance your page in other ways. Here's an example. You can see that it generated a quiz for me with questions, correct answer, and some incorrect answers as well. Okay, here's a scenario now and I've asked the AI to generate not just a quiz, but an assignment at the end of each lesson. So here's 1.7 scenario. It's given me some submission guidelines. It's asked me to write about 500 to 800 words. It's even giving me a grading rubric, just showing me how it's going to grade. And this is where we move into part two, the AI assignment. All right, I'm going to submit. Here's my essay. Send that through. And now the AI assessor comes in. And within about five seconds, we can see that via AI assessor has given me these grades. So it's given me an 18 for understanding, 18 for application, critical thinking, creativity, and organization. So overall, I've done pretty well, I reckon, with a 90%. Now, an administrator can override that grade at any point. Uh, you can also jump in and review the submission by the, the learner and you can comment as well. So that's how that works. Now the next stage is layering this with an AI tutor. Now at the moment I'm using Chatbase to create my AI tutors, but this will exist within the next month or so natively as an optional upgrade within Coursebox. And I'll show you how it works. So I'll upload that and you can give it additional journal articles or you some 
some questions and answers about your training business or, or who you are as a coach, for instance. But when you're happy, you just click Create Chatbot. Okay, and here's one I've got ready. It's called Travbot, and uh, this is my my virtual coach. I'm going to copy that iframe and go back to the publish page, click on AI Tutor. It's important to tick these boxes if you want the tutor to display on the right, otherwise it will display underneath of the page content. Refresh your page, go to preview mode, and you'll see now we've got our AI Tutor. Okay, so that's what you get with Course Box. One, you get an AI instructional designer that helps you structure and create and publish a course using your existing content or from nothing at all, just an idea. Two, you get an AI assessor that will create scenarios for your learners or students, uh, even with a grading rubric. And then it's going to grade using that breakdown of your rubric, give immediate feedback. And then three, we've got an AI tutor. So at the moment, we're layering in using other chatbots and pre-train those with your course content for immediate deep dive answers page by page for your students. And coming soon in the next month or so ahead, Coursebox will have an AI tutor natively within each course. So watch this space uh, for that upcoming launch and let me know if you've got any questions. Thank you.